Hello friends. Okay, so let's get to it. So I am here with Lange, so excited to bring you a really fun new hair tutorial. I'm gonna post the shopping link right here in the comments before I forget, because there is some amazing deals going on. So I'm gonna pin it right there. And then I'm gonna share this to my other pages. So if you're not following those other pages, make sure you do so. I have one called Beauty by Raya Hope, and that's where I do most of my makeup tutorials. So if you wanna see tutorials such as this one, I just got finished doing this live. Um, so go check that out. So Beauty by Raya Hope. And then I have my personal page, of course, which is Raya Coleman. So make sure you're following on there. And all you have to do is click the See First button to follow and make sure you follow me on Instagram. So we're in the middle of house renovations and I've been sharing all about that and fashion. Clearly I love fashion. Um, so make sure you follow me over on Instagram to see all things that I love. Um, my name on there is Rhea Hope as well. And we'll wait for just a few more minutes for more people to pop on. But I'm so excited to do this live with you guys. I've been getting so many questions lately on how I achieve that really fun kind of edgy faux hawk. Just because you have short hair doesn't mean it has to be boring. So I'm excited to show you guys how easy and fast that is. So I just got out of the shower. Obviously I did my makeup. And now we're here. So I always dry my hair with this little towel. This is my lounge. It's their hair wrap towel. Um, so I usually will have this up and then I'll do my makeup while my hair dries, which helps to kind of pull the hair up off of your head, which helps with volume as it dries. Um, and then also, do you ever experience like a ton of frizz when you get out of the shower? It's probably because you're using a cotton towel. If you start using the lounge towel to dry your hair out of the shower, you're going to see the biggest results with anti, with, if I can speak today, with, um, limiting all the frizz and it's so healthy for your hair helps to retain the moisture instead of pulling all that yummy great moisture out of your hair after the shower so definitely snag the launch hair towel so i'm just kind of grabbing my hair and drying it just a little bit before we blow dry but while i do this i'm going to tell you guys what i use in the shower because i get a ton of questions on that too obviously you see i'm a natural brunette but to achieve really gorgeous platinum blonde hair and i'm a dark brunette so if you too have really dark hair and you're wanting something to um, help lighten it up or if you have gray hair and you want something to just give you that really pretty like silver foxy color um, or if you are blonde and you have so much brassiness and you're trying to get rid of it I'm your girl I'm here to tell you what to use okay so for me before I get in the shower I use this guy it's called the smooth healing oil it's so so good it's perfect for all hair types but especially dry hair um, it helps to really hydrate your roots so I usually will put like a pea size amount in the palm of my hand and massage at the root and then I'll leave that in while I get the shower ready while I brush my teeth or I turn the water on get my towel ready I just leave it on for a few minutes just to kind of start off my shower routine with a lot of hydration so I start with this guy right there love 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 this dry hair ladies it's gonna save your life. Also, if you have a really um, like dry scalp, this will really help. Okay, so that's the first thing I do. I get in the shower, I rinse it off, and then I do this combination. So as most of you probably know, uh, purple shampoo, as amazing as it is, can be a little bit drying on your hair. So um, I have figured out a little concoction to still use a product that gets rid of the brassiness but still retains a ton of the moisture so these two right here is what i mix together so i mix the cool tone shampoo with the lather keratin protein shampoo so i mix these two together in the palm of my hand massage it all in my hair and i leave it on for about one to two minutes um i love mixing these two because like i just said this is amazing because it takes away the brassiness and it gives you like really gorgeous like platinum blonde hair um you can also use this on highlights and you can use it if you have gray hair and then this is going to retain that moisture and really like bring the bonds together and heal your hair. So before I forget, make sure to click that share button in your bottom left hand corner, comment something, say hello, let me know where you're watching from, and make sure you click the like button. You do those three things and you are automatically entered into winning the Appleteer flat iron. Um, so super easy, make sure you like, comment, share, that's all you have to do. So after I shampoo, and like I said, I leave this on for about a minute, maybe two, um, then I make sure that we have some good conditioner. So I do the same exact thing. I take the cool tone shampoo conditioner and I mix it with the cream brulee keratin protein shampoo. This is amazing if you have a ton of breakage or if you have really dry hair or 
If you're platinum blonde like I am, the Curatine Protein Shampoo is amazing. It's kind of fun to say very fast. Curatine Protein Shampoo. <laughs> so, cream brulee mixed with the um, Froze Cool Tone Conditioner. So I mix those two together and I leave that on for about like three to five minutes. I rinse it out and then we're ready to get out of the shower and carry on with our routine. But once a month, this is what I do and I swear by this and I really think this is how I can last so long in between getting my hair touched up is this combination right here. So this is called the Violet Purple Toning Shampoo. I get questions all the time, what's the difference between the two purple shampoos? Here's the difference. The Cool Tone Shampoo, the one that's purple, is more gentle on your hair and it's not going to like what do I want to say it's not going to like this if you leave it on too long you'll walk out of the shower with like a purple tint to your hair of course it rinses out but I'm just trying to tell you this is much stronger so you can get away with using this a lot less which in turn helps you have one product that lasts months I think I've had this like going on four months and it's not even close to being empty so for once a month I use the violet toning shampoo it does say on here to use gloves but I've never experienced like my hands turning purple or anything like that so I don't personally wear gloves now with this I only leave it on for about a minute then I rinse it out so if you experience like really stubborn brassiness you're like nothing I use makes my hair platinum or makes my hair blonde or takes away the platinum or takes away the brassiness the Violet Toning Shampoo definitely will. So I use this about once a month and it is really hydrating as well for purple shampoo so I don't need to mix it. So I just use this once a month. So then that same time a month and then also if I'm having like a little spa day to myself I use this guy right here. This is called the Rehab um, Hydrating Mask. Just like it sounds it's literally rehab for your hair. <laughs> so if you have dry hair, if you're trying to grow your hair out, if you have color treated hair, the rehab mask is seriously phenomenal. It's like putting lotion in your hair. It feels so good. Like your hair literally comes out feeling so baby soft. I actually did this one today because I was feeling like my hair is a little bit dry, especially during the winter time. Or if you, this is so random, but if you go camping a lot, like if you're a desert family, I love the rehab mask because it puts back in all those, all that nutrients. Also, if your hair is static or frizz, oh my gosh, Carrie, you read my mind. If you have static or frizz this is also going to help to add that moisture deep into your locks so it's going to be like healing from the outside in you know what I mean so I use this once a month or if my hair is feeling really really dry and I'm trying to have a little spa day I will simply just rinse my hair underneath the sink <laughs> and I will lather up in the rehab mask then I will put on this guy right here this is Lange's um reversible hair towel or hair towel um you know what these are called the little hair caps so I'll put that in and with the heat of this and the rehab mask it you literally only have to leave it on for like 10-15 minutes and then rinse it out you're gonna be like oh my gosh my hair is like a seven-year-old's perfect and soft and glorious and not frizzy at all <laughs> so these two things who needs a good spa day I know I constantly do especially after like really intense bleaching um hair appointments that's right here you guys treat yourself so those two things so that's like my whole shower routine all the products that I use for that so after I get out of the shower although I can get some balm volume which I'm going to show you how to achieve um I naturally have really really thin flat boring hair it's really thin and it's really flat so I have to use all the product to get it reaching for the stars which is totally fine so one of my favorite products and this is amazing if you have thinning hair is this right here this is the select thicket cream this guy you only need about a pea-sized amount you can put this in in the shower when your hair is all damp I usually will wring out my hair and then put it in I actually already put it in today but you only need a pea-sized amount and then you're just going to kind of massage it at the root and then pull through the ends of your hair this is going to give it much more like fullness and volume and it's amazing so thicket um select select thicket cream is what this one's called so like I said if you have thinning hair uh, or thin hair or just flat hair this is really great so you'll do this after you get out of the shower um, so last product I do after I get out of the shower is this guy right here this is the nourishing hair gloss you can't overuse this if you have split ends this is amazing to just pull through the ends it's really soft and soft as in like it's not heavy at all so it's not going to weight on your hair at all so if you're worried like oh I have really thin hair I can't use a bunch of product these products are made for 
thin hair. So don't be worried that it's going to weigh you down. So this is super, super gentle and you only need like a teeny tiny pea sized amount to, um, I mean for everywhere. So you have this forever as well. So it's so, so good. So yes, if you do have color treated hair, all of the products besides the cool tone shampoo would be phenomenal for you. Let me know if you guys have any other questions. So if you have dry scalp, Megan, I see your question. The exfoliating hair mask is amazing. And then I would be, I would follow that up with the rehab hair mask. Yes. Okay. So now we've talked about that. So now let's get our hair ration for the stars. Okay. So obviously I told you already, I did the whole routine with my, um, cool tone shampoo and conditioner. I did my rehab mask. I already did my thicket cream. So now to protect my hair and add some really gorgeous like shine to it. I love this. This is the Menage um, oil hydrating mist. Again, another product that you can't overuse. If you have, if you've been feeling like your hair looks really frizzy or it's really staticky or um, you have really dry hair, I'm like trying to think of all the scenarios. Honestly, everyone and anyone you're gonna love this. So it also acts as a protectant to your hair. So we're gonna use this, and you're just gonna mist it over your hair. It smells so good, you guys, and it's so soft. You, it literally smells like a salon. Like when I use this, which is almost every day, my husband always like, oh my gosh, it smells like you when got your hair done. <laughs> I'm like ah, thank you. So you're just gonna kind of mist that through, and this is gonna act as a heat protectant for all of our flat irons and stuff like that. So we um, do that guy next. All right, so now next thing for a ton of volume, and I always notice a huge difference when I use this versus when I don't use this. This is called the Whip Volumizing Mousse. So obviously it's a mousse, and you, but you only need like that much. That's actually kind of a lot for my hair, but all good. All right, let me find where my napkin go. And like I said before, if you guys have any questions, just message me. If you need help picking out product or anything like that, just message me. And if you haven't done so yet, make sure that you click that like, follow, and share button. So, and I'm just taking this, I put it between my fingers, and now I'm just massaging it through the root, and then I'm going to pull through. And this is not only going to help the volume at the root, but it's also going to help your hair look a lot more voluminous throughout the ends. So like I was saying, to enter into the giveaway to win a flat iron, all you have to do is like, comment, and share. That's it. Like, comment, share. So make sure you do so and make sure you let me know. Yes, it's so good. I'm actually gonna take like the smallest amount. And this part of my hair always has the hardest time standing up. So I really just, you see how I'm just kind of like massaging it at the root? Oh my gosh, it's so good. And you guys, there's a huge sale going on. So um, right now, the flat iron that I'm about to use is only $29. Talk about balling on a budget and still getting some amazing product. The Lee Compact, a uh, hair dryer I'm about to use is on sale for 89, which is a killer deal for this guy, which I'm going to tell you more about that in a second. And then also they have the anniversary BOGO sale. Yes, please buy one, get one 50% off. So don't miss out on that deal while supplies last. You guys know, if you've been shopping with launch for a while, they fly out of product because it's just so much demand. So make sure you check it out. I have my link right here pinned in the comments and in the description. So message me if you don't have my link and I can hook you up with it. Um, it's the only way I get credit. So make sure that you message me if you need any help. Yes, this is my closet. We just moved into our new house and I've been loving it. I know it's so much fun. Okay, so now let's blow dry our hair now that we have all of our product in. So I've been loving the Le Compact for my hair because it's so lightweight. So this is the smallest. It's technically a travel flat, travel hair dryer, but it's perfect if you hate like the weight of hair dryers. This has all the same features, um, has the three speeds, the three heat speeds, and it comes with the different nozzles on it too, which I love. Um, and then, like I said, it's so light. It's so light. You don't feel like you're like, oh my god, my shoulders are hurting so bad. It's amazing. So the way I like to blow dry my hair, I like to use two different brushes. So this one's called the Flexi Brush, and it's so amazing because it has, see how you can see through it? It allows the um, hot air to blow through the brush through your hair, so you're actually cutting down on the time that it takes you to blow dry your hair. So my ladies who have thick hair, who's out there who has thick hair, the flexi brush is the way to go. It comes in multiple sizes. This is a smaller one, but you're going to cut down on the like length of how long it takes to blow dry your hair. So definitely snag the flexi brush. And then the other brush that I swear by is this guy right here. This is the Sienna um, round brush, and this comes in three different sizes. This is the smallest one, so it's perfect. 
Okay, so let's start to blow dry. I'm going to use it on the fastest setting and the second heat speed or second heat setting, not speed. Um, third speed, second heat. <laughs> if I haven't confused you enough, um, because I don't need a ton of heat on my platinum blonde hair. So I'm going to actually turn on my flat iron while we do this too. Okay, so here we go. So I start off with this guy. Just to kind of create some... I saw some comments that hair dryer is called the Lee Compact and it is so amazing for getting all the volume and it's so light you guys and it has all the settings it's amazing and then I saw other questions this is called the flexi brush which is amazing because it lets the air pass through it so if you have thick hair it's amazing for blow drying quickly and then as you saw this guy is going to help to really give that volume so as you saw I really wanted to define this part right here because that's the best part of a faux hawk. You don't want it to look like you're just having a comb over, you know? So to prevent the comb over vibe, the Donald Trump vibe, <laughs> you're gonna just give, um, you really wanna define this part. So the next thing I do is I take just like a simple little hair clip, which by the way, Launch has some really, really cute accessories if you haven't checked those out. Okay, so we're just going to pull the middle section up to find where we have that part just like that. And this is amazing tip if you have really thin hair. So I'm kind of like manipulating my hair. So as my hair cools from being blow dried, it's going to cool back like this. So now I can do the sides in the back. The higher the hair, the closer. That's right. All right. So now we're using the Appleteer flat iron. This is on sale for $29. $29. This is amazing. It's a ceramic flat iron, has multiple seat, multiple speeds, on and off switch, 360 cord, it's awesome. And it's also ceramic, which is perfect if you have really damaged hair or really um, color treated hair if you're trying to grow your hair out. Ceramic is actually the most gentle on that hair type. So um, if you're like me and you're trying to grow your hair out and you also have really color treated hair, stick with the Appleteer, it's the safest option for your hair. And now I use it on the temperature, um, what am I on, 300? but you can kind of play around with the temp. I would start low and then get hotter. So if you're starting, let's say at 300 and you're like, okay, nothing's happening, turn up the heat a little bit more. It just may be because the body of your hair is a little bit thicker um, or like more full. Like your hair strands are like this versus 
like mine are a little bit thinner so I can get away with using a lower heat setting. So kind of play around with it. Everybody is different. So we're going to take this first. Now I want the sides of my hair to lay really flat, but I don't want them to look boring. So I'm going to take this and we're just going to kind of go through. And as you see, I'm kind of turning it like this as you go. Now, if you mess up, make sure you kind of distribute the heat out of your hair with your fingers. So that way you're not going it over and over it with hot, hot, hot. Okay, just like that. And then we're gonna find that part again. These hairs, I'm not sure where they wanna go. Yes, and I love that this flat iron you can use for curling your hair and flat ironing your hair can do both really easy, especially, especially if you have short hair. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you the back. And I do the same thing. I just kind of grab it and twist back. Just to give it some like structure and some body and some texture. Just like this. I'm just gonna go around. Push up, gives you the volume. Yes. Yes, absolutely. And if you guys haven't yet liked, comment, or share, make sure you do so so that you're in the winning to win one of these flat irons, you guys. Okay, so now that we've done that, now we're going to take the top part out. And I'm going to use this guy right here. This is the Deja Vu Dry Shampoo. And I have some really exciting news. Launch actually today launched a brand new dry shampoo. So when you spray this one, it comes out clear, which is perfect if you have blonde hair like I do. But if you don't, um, you're going to really like the new dry shampoo like i said it released today so make sure you snag it before it sells out um it's called the style revival dry shampoo so definitely snag that one it has a stronger um it's a stronger consistency so if you have really really oily hair you're like ran nothing i use takes away this oil grab that it's getting crazy reviews everyone at launch is obsessed with it i'm so excited mine's in the mail on the way to me um, which is perfect it helps you last in between showers as well so this guy uh for the dry shampoo is really good if you don't have super oily hair but you just kind of want to add some grit to your hair which is really good especially if you have um, really hard to curl hair or it just doesn't hold a style very well um, this is really helpful because it's going to add some grit like I just said and then it's also going to absorb any oil that may pop through so that was the dry shampoo but definitely stack the new one I'm so excited to use it all right so now for the appliteer flat iron now for this I usually start like on the sides and I'll just kind of like grab random pieces and I'm kind of figuring out where I want this part to be like really harsh but I want everything going backwards so there's no real rhyme or reason to this I'll just kind of grab it and then start twisting backwards like this so this piece seems to want to go forward so we're gonna grab this one and then roll back see like that now if you have really really like stubborn hair you can piece off your hair, like piece it off in, into sections and do it. If you're like, I'm trying and it's not staying. So Carrie, I'm gonna show you some really good styling products that will really, really help your hair stay in place. Okay, so then I usually will take these parts right here and then twist backwards, kind of at an angle. Same thing over here. Grab it and then twist back like that and if you guys haven't done so make sure you like comment and share let's see who our next winner will be and if you aren't yet make sure you follow me over on instagram as well as here on facebook because i do tutorials like this all the time and i've had all kinds of hair lengths so if you are cutting your hair make sure you sit sure 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 make sure you save this tutorial to your facebook so you can catch it on the replay later and then if you have longer hair and you want to see some different styling videos of mine, check out my YouTube channel. I make it really easy to find me. All you have to do is search Raya Hope. <laughs> okay, so same thing. Okay, so now I'm going to kind of play around with it and see where I need a little more heat. Like this piece is having a mind of its own. So we'll go a little bit slower. 
but the key I feel like with a good faux hawk is that it's not perfect because when it does look perfect it looks like a comb over <laughs> so we don't want that we want it to look kind of edgy and fun all right I think we're, we're close so okay all right so now that we have it pretty defined. Now it's time for styling. So everything looks super good. So we're gonna do this guy right here. So we're gonna take this first and this is called the Gentleman's Pomade. And although it's for, it says gentleman, anyone in the house can use it. I love it because it's clear and it doesn't leave your hair like super clumpy like that. So you're gonna take this and then you're just going to kind of run your fingers through your hair. And this is really going to kind of place the hairs where you want it. If you have any flyaways or anything like that, that really, really helps. But you're going to be really intentional on where you put it. And then I just kind of lay these pieces down. And then I'm kind of like pulling. See that? Pulling it backward. Like so. And like I said, it doesn't you don't want it to look perfect. The messier and more random it looks, the more edgy and kind of fun it is. So the difference between the two flat irons, one is ceramic and one's titanium, which is probably the biggest difference. But you can always message me and I can chat more with you guys about which product is best for you. So if you're not sure, just message me. And also if you have a stubborn hair, like it will not go up, just let it, let it do its thing. Like, fine. You want to lay down, have at it. You lay down. You do you, boo. <laughs> Maybe you'll come join the party tomorrow. Okay. So now that we've done that, now the most important step is this guy right here. This is the Hot to Trot Max Hold Hairspray. I love it because it's so strong. You don't need a ton of it. And it doesn't make your hair, like, super crunchy, which I cannot stand that. A lot of these products, almost everything in this whole line, you don't have to wash your hair the next day. Like, it's not going to feel crunchy or dirty or yucky to where you're like, oh, I need to wash my hair to get it feeling better. You just simply kind of brush it out a little bit, and then you're good to go. So there we are. There we have it. There is your really fun faux hawk. Isn't that fun? See? Short hair doesn't need to be boring. It can be fun and edgy and cute. Yes! I know, right? Color-coded and everything. Isn't that awesome? <laughs> Yes, message me through Facebook um, is the best way to get a hold of me. If you need any recommendations on hair products, hair tools, let me know and I would be thrilled to help you. Uh, make sure you follow me over on Instagram. My name there is Raya Hope. And then make sure you follow me here on Facebook if you enjoy a good makeup tutorial. I also do those. And if you need any help with skincare or makeup, just message me. I would love, love to help. I know, isn't that so fun? I swear these products are incredible. So don't miss out on the crazy good deal of the flat iron being $29. And then definitely grab the Lee Compact, whether you're using it for travel or just for home. Um, I love it because it's super lightweight. Let me pull it off the ground. Super lightweight. And you have all the same speed settings and heat settings that the bigger ones do, which is awesome. Definitely check out all of the products. They're still in stock. And make sure that you grab the brand new dry shampoo today um before it sells out so i love you guys thank you so much for watching make sure that you shop here in the comments or in the description of the video and message me if you guys need anything i love you guys i will be doing a closet tour for sure and a house tour and all the new uh renovations um over on my instagram story so make sure you're following me over there and i will see you soon thanks guys bye